Hey guys, I'm giving you a guide on the completely new game mode that Riot released called like Soul Fighters. Um, I, we gotta go fast. So there's no runes in the game. You get your starter items here, which are super valuable and you should start every game with a starter item. Uh, in this case, I'm actually playing some Kale and I'll show you why Kale can be good. But overall champions that are good in this mode are usually bruisers or full tanks. So you'll see stuff like Mundo, Jax, even Master Yi is pretty good in this mode as well. Uh, you start out with three points, so you level to level three, and you immediately jump into the first round. The map is completely random, and you play against a random team here, guys. It's a 2v2v2. Uh, there are plants on the ground that you want to kill. These things give you ultimate back, and they also heal you, give you shield. Okay, so you can see how I was healing off of those plants, right? So now I'm going for the plant here. Uh-oh. Fight me, bro. No, no. And the fire starts closing in once uh, some time passes. Now I have to hit the plant. Ah, oh, shoot. Give me the plant. Oh my god, I couldn't get the plant. Round loss. But that's okay, because even if you are if you get a kill, you get to 350 gold. I think two kills will give you 750. At the end of the first round, you get something called an augment. There's three rarities. I think it's like silver, gold, and prismatic. And you can reroll twice during a game. So you have to choose very carefully what you want. This one gives me electric and phase rush. This one gives me 60 ability haste. I kind of like 60 ability haste. I would rather reroll for a more rare card once we get those because you only get two rerolls. So I'm going to go with the 60 ability haste here. I have a Zin Zhao on my team. And he has armor, 30% armor pin and magic pin. This guy has electric Q. This guy can buy infinite mythic items if he wants. So we're against Zyra Maokai. So he heals and she gains AP when she hits enemies. So we kind of don't want to feed her. Oh. Oh. I'm feeding her. I'm going to go for the plant. We're just denying Maokai here. Okay. Um, yeah. Bro, she is. Bro, honestly, she is a pain. She's trying to get this plant, so I can't, but I have E, so. Uh, Maokai's coming. Wow, he's already full HP. See, that's the power of the plants right there, how fast you gain that H or HP. All right. So we'll wait for this plant here. Auto resets are great for that. Rain champs are also great for that. Okay, I'm going to run down. Oh, he just went on the wrong side. He's like clear on the other side here. Me and him have to work together here. Oh, we win this. Like, dude, there's nothing Maokai can do. He's stuck on the other side. <laughs> and there we go. We picked that one up as well. So you also get an arcane sweeper that you can use to reveal things. And after the third round, so on round three, you get enough for your boots. It's always like this. It never changes per game. The augments are random, but the way that you get your gold, it's kind of like TFT if you ever played that. It's up here in the top, right? So I'm going to go for some Berserker Greaves. And uh, you'll see that every item is balanced to have the same cost efficiency. So these 3,000 items here all give about the same amount of stats. Uh, they actually added some new items, like this one lets your spells crit. So there's a lot of new items that you're going to have to learn about as well. Plant spawns in the middle on this one. Oh, well, that was, that was bad timing, huh? I'm going to get froze. Nice. Kited. Nice. And we run the round. You also see how much HP you're going to lose when the round starts. When you finish a round, you can spectate the other people and see what they're doing. Check out their items while you're between rounds here. So in this case, I'm just looking at the augments that they have. Right? It's kind of important. This guy got 25 AD, 10 ability haste. Now, listen, when I say that the augments have rarities, everybody in the same game gets a chance at the same rarity, right? So you can't have a rare rarity and somebody gets a normal one. You all get rare or you all get normal. So everybody's here. Everybody's augments here are like mine, which is a normal augment. So now we should be getting 3,000 gold on this round. And then next round we get uh augments so now we have to pick any item they all stack about the same so it's kind of your choice on which one you want i'm gonna go for gunju's now 
There's a lot of great synergies with um, augments. I think the augments are really what makes the game fun here. But let me let me show you some of the new items. So this is Atma's Reckoning. You get crit chance per bonus health. Zephyr gives you attack speed one hit plus tenacity and ability haste. Uh, this item gives you crit chance plus crit chance on spells. I'll show you some more as we get the game going. Hmm. No, thank you. I'm not going to ulti him right away because he's always going to use his uh, ulti. Oh, well, no thanks on that. They get one plant. I outrange her plants. All right, we're, we're out guiding him there. Okay. I would like to go for this plant here. It's growing. So we want to grab this one. I'll take all that. Also, those plants lower your ulti cooldown. Also, since there's no runes, you don't have lethal tempo, but the augments can fix that. Nice. That's a kill. All right. Secured. Yeah, the burning thing just kind of slowly burns you. We'll grab this. Now we have an augment. This is a fun part. Electrocute. One ability powder. Your abilities apply on hit effects. I don't really care about that. I'll reroll. 40% crit. Life steal. Ah. <sighs> You enter a cannon launching. That one's pretty cool. Oh, extra attack range. So this one gives me extra attack range, which is obviously really great for kiting. It was a hard choice. Let's see my ally gets. Cannon's really good if you're like trying to engage. Become invisible or until you attack. Okay, so you can replace your summoner spell. You get two summoner spells. One is flee, which is like ghost, and the other one is flash, right? You only get 150 as a range. I don't get 250 attack range. Oh. Okay, and then sometimes there's random events, like that wolf. My kiting is terrible, by the way. I'm gonna ghost. Nice. Alright. Yo, these wolves are so annoying. There's some really annoying ones, like uh, Lux that'll randomly ult you as well. Nice. There we go. Hitting that down. We can spectate the other arena. Uh, are there any questions? Like, my, if my chat could ask questions that they're wondering or anything I'm forgetting about, let me know. Oh, yeah. Let me show you some more items. Um, so, you can see that the items are balanced, and they show you the balance by showing you the orange letters, right? The mythics are the same here. Uh, this item's here. Mark your current location after four seconds. Return to it. And I gotta buy. I'll buy a Witsen. Oh, no, no, no. I want Nashers. Nashers, too, is really good. 45% attack speed. Also, like, for tanks, the heart steal's really good. There's also pots. So your leftover gold, whenever you get little kills, you get a little bit of gold. You can save it up or you can use it if you think you'll need it. I personally like to save mine. Uh, also, some things will have cooldowns of like one round. So Flash has a cooldown of one round. Guardian Angel has one round. Roa takes two rounds before it turns into something. The best cards. They, there's a lot of great ones like Fiora's Blade Waltz. All right, here we go. I got a sub. Thank you. Thank you for the sub. Oh, I got Freylorded. Oh, yeah, that set does true damage to anybody standing in it, by the way. So you kind of want to... Why would you flash? You're dead anyway. So you might as well, like, you want to try to avoid it. But whenever you kill set, he will attack the enemy. But it still hurts you, right? He will attack whoever is on the other side here. So in this game, they don't have any random event. So you haven't seen the Lux event. So there's a Lux that sits in the middle and she spins around. And if she spots you, she'll laser. And then there's also a Pike event that will attack the furthest away champion that's out there. Thank you, Bane, for the sub, bro. Yeah, apparently there's no attack speed cap. There's no runes. And uh, I think it comes from here. So here you go. You can look at arena stat adjustments. So apparently your stats go up based on your uh, teammates missing. On hit damage. Wait, we get on hit damage? On hit damage equal to 1.5%. Double the partner is dead. Interesting. Okay, so, like, you can see if we sold our item, we would be 200 away. So, if we got one more kill in this round, I would have four items here. But I don't, so. Uh, let's look at the enemy team comp. I mean, honestly, none of them are feeling too difficult to deal with. 
Maybe I guess Zephyr for the tenacity and move speed. Run me around here. Oh yeah, there's a new item here. This one increases armor. Death Cap's actually weaker. Uh, the ultimates reset every round. Yes. There's also a really good uh, augment that'll give you extra levels. So you can be level 25 while the enemy is level 18. So I used it and I was a level 16 Kale before the enemy hit level 16. It was pretty great. That's my kill. Thank you, sir. I'll take this plant, I guess. Bro, that Zyra plant looks like a real plant. There we go. Starting to scale. Yeah, scaling champions are pretty scary in this mode because you do scale kind of quickly. All right, we didn't get any rare this game, but later in the video, you'll see me get some rare ones. Permanent red and blue buff. Your attacks fire a bolt at an additional target, applying reduced damage and playing on hits. Your heals grant shield. So I think I would probably rather have the red and blue buff. It's pretty nice to have the extra CDR plus like hiding and stuff. Oh, now you can see I have enough to sell an item. Oh, Gunblade's back too. AD, Omnivamp. So I have enough to sell my item and get another full item here, which is why I like to save my stuff. So you can see I'm an entire item up on these guys. Well, I mean, they have the starter item, but obviously my item's better. Oh. All right. That Zephyr didn't do anything for me, did it, guys? <laughs> oh, my God. D uh, tenacity, boys. Maybe I should get Mercs. Uh, and you can have up to four augments in a game, depending on how long the game lasts. Yeah, I mean... Bro, I don't know. Like, I had to... Had to be more careful or maybe get mercs or something. Oh, here's Deluxe Event. So you see she's like dashing around and yep. She does a lot of damage. Point. See how much damage she did there? And she just spins around until she spots somebody. Yeah, I know. I had more items over them and then they killed me anyway. Uh. Alright, let's go Banshee Veil. Vale. I mean, dude, I'm Kale. I want to do damage. I don't want to be no wussy. We'll see with the Banshee Veil. I'll get a Wits. Kite him, kite him with my Wits, guys. Yeah, see, if you had that one perk that gives you more levels, right? You would already be level 18, 19 right now, something like that. So you would be sitting with the level 16 ulti way longer than them. So we have an augment in like four rounds or something. That's 18 HP. Ooh, I don't think we're going to last that long. Oh. Okay, so whenever one gets knocked out, the highest team has to sit out and wait. So you can just spectate. So we don't have to do any fighting right now. So we get to just sit back and relax here while they go in. All right. Beautiful. Let's uh, take a look at the shop again to see if there's anything I'm missing while they're fighting. New tank items. Uh, here we go. Blood letters curse. We have the Atmos. I already showed you that. Nobody likes to support items, let's be honest here. Uh, there's new boots as well. These let you walk over walls. And there's also a potion that does nothing. Ooh, dude, Kazakh's actually doing work. Oh. Yeah, you don't want to sit in that set. So you can see he continuously revives. I think Cho'Gath can use him to farm noms. Yep, 1,500 true damage to that dude. Oh, yeah, dude, this Maokai's in trouble. Oh, my God, he just healed the full. Never mind. Oh, there's some more true damage. Bro, what is this? Dude, they never die. Bro, Maokai never dies. Bro, wow. He heals so much. What are his items? He has... Wow, he has support items. He's literally playing support Maokai. All right, so now we could drop our items and go full build. I'm going to get a Guardian Angel. So we're full build. I'm also going to buy a pot. So I'll get the extra damage. And this is potentially the last round. If we lose... If we lose, there is more augment. Another augment phase. So maybe I can show you guys a rare augments here. Oh, now we have the Samira. Samira uh, juggles a mobilized opponent or something like that. Oh, I don't like the sound of that, to be honest. Yeah, 
Yeah, I don't know, dude. He didn't seem that hard to kill, did he? Sorry about that, but you know, sometimes you just gotta carry it yourself, guys. All right, back in on the Master Yeezy. Look at all these AP champions. I have a Tarek on my team. I didn't ask for this, guys, okay? He's the lame guy, not me. Lame guy, if not me. All right, dude, I love these early game fights as Master Yi. They're so much fun. Oh, I didn't get a point in E. Well, that's fine. A little something from Targon. Law, he just blasted himself away from that. I got this. I'm playing Master Yi. They can't beat me. What are you going to do, buddy? You done. Sit down. Best Master Yi ever. All right. So for Master Yi, I typically like to kind of go on hit. But you can go crit or Navari as well just because the augments are so good for crit. All right. Not bad. I mean, dude, it could go either way. So we'll have to see what we get for... Oh, these are the rare ones, finally. Gain Lethal Tempo and Conqueror. Right? Like, dude, that's not bad at all. Lethal Tempo and Conqueror on Yi. Let's go. I mean, Mashi loves Lethal Tempo and Conqueror. Especially with Terra Culti, but we easily stack them both very, very easily. Now, there's so many good rare ones. Casting your ultimate gives you invulnerability. Your attacks reduce your cooldown. Your attacks grant you 10 movement speed. That's actually pretty good on Terra. This guy has Fiora. Your abilities apply burn, and then this guy has Zhonya's. Lame. Lame. Bro, Yi is so much fun in this mode early on now. All right, keep going, Tarek. I believe in you. Okay, I would like to move. Keep getting them, Tarek. Keep getting them. You know, I'll get it. I don't mind. I don't mind getting a low kill. 700 gold for us there. I mean, dude, honestly, we can just kind of chill and wait for the plant. Why even waste flash? Like, what's this guy going to do? It's 2v1. We all heal him and everything. Like, dude, just he's... It, the thing is, his flash has a delay. Right? Like, he's not going to have flash for next round. Then he just used it on an obviously lost round there. All right. So, now we get some gold to buy some boots. I'm going to buy mercs. Honestly. <laughs> like, just buy mercs. No biggie, no biggie, no biggie. Also, keep in mind that these items actually count as legendaries, so... So when you get your mythic, they're pretty good. Alright, we got Highlander. We got another point Meditate. I'd like to get two points of Meditate early for these fights. I got Mercs for these fights, which is nice. Which gives actually bonus tenacity here. Let's go get the plant. Wait, why, why ulti? Oh no. I was gonna go get plant. I'm gonna let him hit it. Oh, well, he gets his ulti back if he hits it. Oh, this is why we get level two meditate, boys. Come here, jump onto me. Yeah. 
Huh. Huh. <laughs> Let him burn, baby. Oh, dude, that was close. Almost. He almost got me. I let him burn a little. Let's get level three. He almost got me. So I think out the gate, what I'll do is I'll get a Navari or I'll get the whip. So the idea is that we might get like a crit augment that we want and then we'll get Navari. But if we don't get a crit augment and the next augment here, then we'll just swap to uh, Guntus because like they're all AP, right? Except for Pantheon, who we're actually probably playing against right now. No, we're playing but against Iron Lux. You can tell because of the HP bars. That's who you're playing against next. Bonk, bonk, bonk. All righty. Is this set? Where are the plants? In mid, right? No? The plants in mid. I hope that hit her. You see how my ulti cooldown is whenever I hit the plant like that? My ulti cooldown's at 27 seconds. If I hit the plant one more time, I get ulti again. It works on Tarek, too. Oh, it's for him. Nice. Secured another kill. Yeah, that wits end already doing work. Getting some damage. LeBlanc using that blade wall. So does that do physical damage? Mm. All right, here we go. Gain attack range, armor pin, and magic pin. I'm going to get the attack range, and now we can actually go for Guntu's Rage Blade. So we get attack range from lethal tempo, and we also get attack range from that. So actually, I have a feeling that our attack range is going to be really, really far away. I'm going to get max level meditate. Yeah, you can completely duo in this mode. All right, let's see my attack range. Oh, I can't do it because my partner took so long, I couldn't hit the dummy. Dude, my attack range is going to be nutty. It's actually going to be nutty. It's going to be so far. Like, look how far it already is without lethal tempo. I need to go get that plant. That plant will get me Highlander. Oh, baby. Actually busted. Dude, look at my attack range. It's huge. Oh. All right, so let's get a Guntu's Rage Blade. Bro, I'm basically a range champ right now. Like, if I get lethal tempo. All right, my partner could get out nice and quickly so I can test it. Look at this. Look at this range. That's without lethal tempo stacked. Oh, my God. So basically my plan is to just wait for this and then ulti onto it and then get double ulti. Oh baby. Bro, it's impossible to play against Tariki. What a mode. What a mode. Look, look at me kill the plant from over here. This is ridiculous. A rapid fire. Yeah, that's only one auto, though. All right, so we got... Though it would be kind of funny because I attack fast enough. That's actually a really funny idea. All right, let's do it. Rapid fire. I'm, I'm willing to troll a little bit for you guys. All right. We have a rapid fire cannon, guys. It starts out fully stacked. Look at my range. We're gonna get a point in Alpha. Oh my God, look how far I attack from. Look at this, look at this. I don't even need to move. Oh my god, all these Zanyas. Oh 
Oh my god, look how far I attack. Look at this. Watch this. I'm just going to walk up and I'm going to hit her from here. <laughs> dude, the range is insane. I'm basic. Dude, I have like the same attack range as like an AD carry. Oh my god, dude. We're nutty. This is actually the most insane comp I've ever done. All right. 40% crit chance. No. Gain attack damage scale with your attack speed, which is honestly probably worth it. More attack damage. I mean, eh, yeah. So that gave me 50 AD. Whether or not you think 50 AD, I had to be holder. Um, let me see. What do we want? I think I want a maul Mamordia, so I'm going to drop this and grab a maul. Oh, wow. Somebody already got knocked out. I think maul Mamordia will be really good into basically these full APs here. Alrighty. Bro, they rolling. They rolling. I'm good. I'm getting the plant. So remember, always use Highlander before planting. Bro, he's double Zanyas? Are you kidding me? All right, I'm coming. Oh my God, it's disgusting, dude. All right. Terry Gideon, this is definitely a choice. Whoops. <laughs> Whoops. Dude, I told you guys. I didn't do it. He did it. It wasn't me. All right. It wasn't me. Ba -da 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 -da. Dude, they, they hate us. They hate us. I don't blame them. I'd hate us too. I hate us too. All right, here it is. Dude, we haven't lost a round yet because of this. All right, what are they up to here? Dude, the enemy team's a little salty about our picks, but honestly, I don't blame them. I'd be salty too. This is ridiculous. Well, I was kind of hoping the other people would win because I have so much MR. Lily, I'm going to need you to win this. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay. Um, I definitely think we drop something and get a Zephyr. And this sells for 2.1. I don't think rat I don't think the rapid fire is doing that much, but I'm down to keep it just I mean, guys, we can lose so many rounds that I'm down to keep it. Like we can literally lose two rounds. So we'll we'll keep it. Oh yeah, I could buy pots. Eh, that's okay though. I don't care. I don't need no pots. They do, but I don't. Oh my god, look at my range. Look at that range. It's insane. It's insane range. 